Yeah, we were very pleased with our victory there. Uh, as we discussed after the match, that it was it wasn't conditions suited to South African conditions. We moved on now to Wanderers, which looks more like the conditions that we're used to. Um, but once again, uh, we haven't asked for anything over the top. We've just asked for a wicket that's got good pace and bounce. Um, and it looks like hopefully we'll get that. Yeah, I think once again, India will come back um, with a point to prove. I mean, obviously they're a proud team that that wouldn't want to go down 3-0. So we're expecting once again a good, a good challenge from them. Um, for us as a team, pretty simple, just be doing the things that we've been doing right over this series, uh, do it well. Whether it's uh, batting and partnerships, getting those partnerships together, as I said after the second test, the difference between us and India is I feel that's been, a, you know, there's more batters contributing to that partnership. So that's going to be once again a very, very much a key factor on the conditions like that. Uh, if you do get in uh, as a batter to try and with your partner string together a nice partnership. Um, and then both teams have been taking 20 wickets. Uh, so I think once again, I, I assume that that will happen. Um, we've got a strong bowling attack on, on conditions that will suit them. So I think once again, the, the onus would be on the, on the partnerships in the batting department. That was surprising actually for me. I mean, I didn't know that that stat that you spoke about. Um, obviously, when you don't follow a team closely, you don't really have an eye on it all the time. But you know, I read something that they've changed their team every single time. Yeah, and that's remarkable. I mean, uh, I don't, I don't, I don't see how we'll ever be able to do that. Uh, we try and have a bit of consistency, um, string together a team. It's obviously worked for India and India. Um, but in terms of the opposition, no, it doesn't make a difference. Uh, you. You plan for everyone, you prepare for everyone, and whoever plays, it, it's not like it surprises us or anything. Big. I mean, I said it before, this, you know, just playing against India, we don't get the opportunity a lot to be in a position of strength where we can beat them 3-0. Uh, but yeah, consistency is something that you want to have as much as possible. Um, leading into the Australian series, we want to we wanna go in with that momentum that we, we've been gathering over the last two games. Australia's been playing some really good cricket, so by no means are anyone in the team thinking that this is just a an opportunity to take our foot off the gas. We we really motivated to try and to try and get a three 0 down. Yeah, they've played some good cricket here. I remember the last test we played against Ingl India was a fantastic test match. Um, you know, as I said, their bowling is good. Their, their bowling is really good. They've come over this time around with a very good seam attack, and if you have that you'll be able to compete. Uh, we have got a fantastic seam attack as well, so it will be the battle of those two. Uh, but for me, obviously, the, the pressure is on making sure that we can keep their the batsmen under pressure. You know, it's been a pretty quiet series for, for most of them. Um, and if we can keep doing that, then, then we'll change the, that stat that you speak about.